Hello, it's Mark Matosh Chief from Markham 3D, and today we're going to be talking about a very simple tool that is semi, not really, kind of, probably not like hard ops, but you can get kind of same, not really results. And it comes free with Blender. So let's start off by going edit, preferences, and type in Carver and enable the Carver add on. So I'm just going to go into orthographic mode by pressing numpad one. I'm going to start off by doing control shift X, and now we're in. From here, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to left click first, click and drag, bam, we've made a cutout. Let's come, we can do it from any angle and we can go like so. And there we go, we started cutting stuff out. However, let's just say we want to do a line. Let's press space and now we can go into line mode. And then when I'm done, I can go left click and press space bar and then we've cut that out. I can click here and bring it down. And then if I press spacebar, a single line actually won't work. Control shift X again, space. Now we're in our line. I'm going to left click and bring it over here and press spacebar. And there we go. We've kind of cut that out, you little ripper. And last but not least, I can press spacebar again and we can do a circle. <laughs> and then obviously using the line tool, we can just make custom shapes. Boop. Cool bananas. Let's just start afresh and let's start creating some booleans. So what I can do is control shift X again with a rectangle. I'm going to draw my rectangle and I can hold shift and it'll reball. So now we've kind of got this um, two separate objects now. And then obviously if we come into the modifiers, we just add in our bevel. Well, that's a big boy, isn't it? 0 0.01 and come up into here, bevel 0.01. And so now we've kind of got these, you know, plates happening. And of course, control shift X, we can do everything we did before space bar, you know, we can draw a line like so hold shift. And then we'll just press space. Wow. And that's all the slicing and dicing wonderfulness. Let's select everything, delete, let's shift a, because there's a little bit more to this. I can go control shift X once again, I can press B. And now we've kind of got all these different types of brushes. And if I press W, we can cycle through or press X and it goes the other way. And then what I can do is I can scale this in and just press S to scale. If I want, I can press D and then I can just press left click and that will assign it to where it needs to go. And well, let's do shift space bar. And now you can see that it's made its wonderful little cut. Lovely jubblies. Let's control Z on that puppy. And then we have a very quick introduction to the Carver tool. It comes free with Blender. Please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out. It keeps you up to date with my content. If there's any other Blender add-ons that you want me to review, please leave a comment below.